I'm with the guy that closes things down, the nightmare, Felipe Vasquez. How are you doing? Walk us through what makes you so good. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. The nightmare does it one, two, three. Raise the Jolly Roger. I don't even know. Like, I mean, I walk. I got run into the in the bullpen and everything, but other than that, I just. Did you always throw hard? Swing and a miss, struck him out. 101. Swing and a miss, struck him out. 100. Good night. When I signed in 07, I used to throw 86. 86. 86. So it, you were throwing 86 miles 86. an hour, and now you you hit 101, 102. 101, 102. Got him for heat from the nightmare. Oh, 101. Do you remember the first time you threw a ball 100 miles an hour? It was against Chris Davis when I was in the Nationals. Almost had to reach back for that one. That's the first time he's hit 100 this year, folks. You saw it on the scoreboard? I saw it on the scoreboard. You saw it, so you threw the I pitch knew, and you, I knew, I knew, you, I knew, you knew it. I knew, you I knew, I knew it, it was 100. Runner, right? I was like, ooh, that came out hard, and I turned around at 100. I was like, yeah. And then after you hit 100, then did it become easier that once you knew that you could do it, that it was like, man, I can, I can Actually, do this. Actually, I thought I was the hottest that I was going to throw in my life. I didn't, I didn't, I never knew I was going to throw 102, 101. He rears back and fires. Struck him out, 101 in the zone. And Vasquez puts away the six shooter. Show me your grips. Do you throw a four seam fastball? Yeah, I throw. How do you hold it? Just like the regular front seam, like everybody else. Four seam like four that? Four seam. Sometimes I open it when I don't feel the grip. I open it and I close it. I play with it. Okay. A little two seam for the you lefties. You throw two seam also? Sometimes. Run the ball in on a left. For the lefties, yeah. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Up and in with the heat. There it is. 101 from the nightmare. And raise the Jolly Roger. Okay, so show me the, cur the curveball. The curveball, I started grabbing it like that because I feel like I can control it more instead of going in the seam, so I grab it like like an actual two seam, so it, it actually works. <laughs> Swing and a miss, struck him out on a curve. Swing and a miss. That was a good breaking ball. Okay, and then now you come up with this great pitch to the straight changeup. Struck him out with the Bucks Bunny changeup, raised the Jolly Roger. Show me the grip on the straight change. Is it the circle change? It's like a, yeah, it's a regular circle change, but it's not four seam change. It's like actually two seam change. That's why he has that movement. Circle changeup. Oh yeah, it took a little off the change of pace. And I play with it like I move my middle finger around so that way I can cut it or I can sink it inside. That's almost cruel the way he pulled the string on that. When you're warming up to come into a game, how many pitches does it take for you to be ready? Three to four. Three to four. Three to four pitches and you're ready to come into a game? Yeah, because I throw like 10 in the bullpen, so 13, 15, that's good for me. The nightmare ends it with 100 miles an hour. He strikes out the side in order. Hey, there you have it. Best of luck to you, Felipe Vasquez. The guys are throwing 100 right here. Big part of the Buckos bullpen. Oh!